Yo, what is up beautiful people? Welcome back to a brand new video and today we have another installment of Slayer. Now we're 70k away from 93 Slayer, uh, but before we jump into it, I would just like to thank everyone for massive support shown on the latest videos and uh, with that being said, the first task is now Dust Devils, which is one of the best tasks to get, so it'll get us close to 93 Slayer. Let's get started. Another superior, and we get just the dark totem piece, that's fine. Superior number two, and then after that we got ourselves 105 Krakens, and for the first time ever I completed the full task in one trip. I just got so many food drops that I was able to juggle just about everything, and here you can see the profits from a single task, not bad. Oh, and I forgot to mention, I also got to 93 Slayer in that task, the pop-up didn't happen, so that's slightly unfortunate. After that, I got 15 Zoras, uh, I decided to take 15, and I made a nice little bit of cash while doing so as well, so really liking that task, but in the future I'll probably just take 3, just for that faster Slayer gains. And just like that, the Zora task was completed, so 15 of them got me about 2 million just in loot, so very very quick 2 million and you kill Zora extremely fast while you're on a Slayer task. And then after that, it was time for more Black Demons, so during that I obviously played some Deadman mode, qualified an extra account, so we have 3 accounts in the tournament, and uh, yeah, it's gonna be spicy man, I'm looking forward for the next one. Another pretty cool accomplishment that I actually completely missed is 20 million strength experience. Moving close to 28 million hit points as well, so that is pretty awesome. Um, and nearly done with the task as well. We got another superior. Alright, let's see what do we get from this one. Let's hope for a heart. Room battle legs and eddy legs. Interesting. 570k and two granite moles from this task, not bad. And the next one is trolls again, let's go ahead and do those. I'm starting to quite like the troll tasks, they're like super fast and yo this is actually sick, that's the first ever smoke devil task on 93 slayer, meaning that first things first I'll kill the boss because it's one of the requirements for the achievement diary, so I'll do one boss kill. And then after that, this is the fastest uh, Slayer experience in the whole game. Uh, what you do is you cannon, uh, cannon them and barrage them at the same time. I'll show you how I do it, but first things first, let's kill one boss, it's for the diaries. It is worth noting though that you don't actually need to be on the task to do the first kill, but, I, but since I'm not about to catch a thousand chinchampas anyways, it is for me, I was just waiting for the task to do that one kill. Here it is, just killing a boss one time. Also, it is fair noting that I don't actually have rune light on this computer, it just wouldn't run for me, I guess my computer just sucks that much, so I don't exactly know the cannon placements, um, but uh, right, we got a rune dagger, but there you go, that's why we did it for elite tasks, uh, but now I need to gear into a mage gear, and I'll show you how I do this task, and it is about 170, 100 to 90 even, KXP an hour if you're perfect with it, so it's a really really awesome task. First big smoke devil, which is nuclear smoke devil. Awesome to see. Let's see what do we get from this one. Oh, oh, okay. We just got an occult from. Uh, we just got an occult from a superior. That is very nice. Oh, that is really nice. 800k right there. Beautiful. And yeah, as you can see, that's the way I do it. Like, I kind of just. Um, well, now it's all messed up because of a superior, usually it's not that messed up. But usually I use these bones to like lure things and then I stay two tiles away from it. So they nicely stack up in this triangular form. So when they are so when I want to lure south of them to stack up, I come north. And then when I want northern, northern ones to stack up, I come south. And then all the ones from the north will run to this spot right here. So uh, really happy with the occult right there, actually. Another one. Alright, nothing special from this one. Another one. And what do we get? I'm gonna assume just an air battle staff, but it's the XP that matters, so beautiful. Three superiors already in one task, that is really nice. 
this is honestly by far my most favorite task just the like if you just listen to some good music and you just focus on it it is so nice it is such such a fast experience task as you can see 500k left to a level uh, but honestly it's just so nice like all the damage you do all the experience you gain all the running around everything is just so nice once you get the rhythm of it and once you have them nicely stacked like that it's just that awesome feeling um I don't know when you get the massive XP drops. I don't know, I just really, really like it. The only thing I hate about this is all the money I leave behind, especially now that I'm picking up the cannon and whatnot. Wait, this is probably worth less than this though. Um, but yeah, I always leave a couple hundred K on the floor, it feels like during these tasks, but hey, it's all good, man. All for that experience, 520K left till 94, really, really good. And now the new task on the list is some call fights, some really quick experience and really quick task in general. Uh, I need to get my points up, man. Uh, I'm only on 800. I've been skipping a little bit too many. So need to get a lot of points before 95 because of Hydra. Easy points. The next one is... Ooh, we're killing Jad. Let's go. But first, unfortunately, I have to sell some of the stuff from the looting tab because we need money to buy more runes, more cannonballs, all that sort of things. So I'll just be selling some stuff from this, ta uh, this tab. As you can see, I only have 2 million in cash. I might sell a couple of things here that I'm not going to need. Um, but yeah, we're just going to sell a bunch of things. You know what? When do I have this dragon crossbow? I'm not really going to PK with it anyways. Yeah, that's fine. We're gonna sell a bunch of things like that, get some money, buy some cannonballs and other supplies, and then go straight into that jet task. One thing that I still don't have is granite boots, which will be the best in slot boots for when the new boss gets released. And unfortunately, they are quite expensive. God damn. All right, so you know what? I'm just gonna try to do a quick little Mika merch right here. Um, because I'm not gonna need them yet. Actually, nah, you know what? I'll keep them. I will keep them for now, but what I will do, though, is, um, I'm actually going to invest some money into trying to buy them for, let's say, 3 mil. Actually, what's the mid? Uh, let's put it to... Let's do it like this. Boom. Uh, I'll see if I can buy them over time, and then I can definitely sell them for more on the day. And there we go, another jet completed, that is jet number 7, since the kill count is in the game. Do we get a pet? Unfortunately no pet this time. Once again, I'm not gambling the capes until we have 28 of them, so that goes straight into the bank. And we're gonna go straight for the new task as well. So we're 500k or 485k away from a level. And we get some cave kraken boss, we're gonna kill 3. Uh, because it gives bonus experience once you finish the boss task. So let's get that out of the way in literally a couple of seconds. Yo, shout out to this man Adlero for being a cool dude and letting me uh, quickly finish three Krakens. Obviously, I didn't want to buy the private area. Absolutely no reason for that. Um, but there we go. Let's take a new task. Thank you once again. We are gonna get ourselves some Black Demons. One of my favorite tasks simply because of how AFK it actually is. I really really like it so we're gonna quickly gear up and uh, just afk the shit out of that one um, and I might play some deadman mode on the side. Finished up with the black demon task I actually edited most of the video already for this episode the next one black dragons really quick skip um, but the cool thing is 458,000 experience away from um, from uh, 94 slayer which is awesome um, but yeah, let's do the skip task real quick. Yesterday a guy in the comments asked me where the small black dragons are. If we look at the world map, we are currently in Taverly Dungeon. If we go to the world map, that is right next to Falador. Uh, and you just go up these steps right here. On the left part of the Taverly Dungeon, you have those guards on the right side. And here you have it, baby black dragons. Those are not iron dragons, as you thought. Those are baby black dragons. Hopefully that's helpful. My recorder unfortunately crashed, but we got the task of Smoke Devils. However, I'm going to uh, wait with that until the next episode. Holy. Th th there's fireworks happening. 
All right, anyways, um, fuck, man. And I'm disturbed, okay? I don't know what I wanted to say. I wanted to say something nice for the ending of the video, but now I'm confused. Either way, that's gonna be all for today. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. And if you did, make sure to give the video a quick little like. Comment down below uh, anything you really want. And with that said, Thank you very much for an amazing year. We got about 25,000 new subscribers in the year and we got about 25,000 new followers on Twitch this year as well. So really, really crazy year for me and I'm really, really grateful. So I'll see you guys in 2019 and until then, have an awesome day. Bye-bye.